Yeah, um, I mean, still, that's, that's just the nature of the beast of Juice Box, man. A lot of strong competitors. Louis Money going to be moving on to another top three finish. I think he's had a couple of these now in the past few weeks. But, uh, yeah, Skittles going to be a tough one to take on here because Skittles has been absolutely on fire. So, Louis Money better be coming in with his best top game right now because uh, it's, it's going to be tough. It's going to be real tough. Yeah, I mean, uh, we saw Louis Money fall to losers earlier to a different young link in Colonies. It was a 2 0 victory. Louis Money tried Palatina and Falco, lost both the games. So now this is going to be uh, even more uh, a different play style of young link. And these two have gone at it multiple times. They traded sets back and forth. So I'm very curious to see how it's going to go. And if he does decide to go Palatina, it can be kind of tricky because. Uh, Skittles' his own brother is a really uh, incredible Palatina player, so it's going to be very, very you know, difficult if he decides to go down that road. Yeah, no, it's it's definitely going to be very tough indeed. Um, I'm really interested to see what character Louis Money is going to be taking out, though. Uh, I think Falco is a good choice against Young Link. I can see that being pretty good. But yeah. uh, there's, there's no really way of knowing uh, before Louis Money, before like, all this uh, quarantine stuff happened, Louis Money was uh, highly ranked, especially with his Fox. Uh, mm -hmm. he, was known, he was known in early Ultimate for his Dr. Mario. His Dr. Mario beat Sam at Prospect 2019. His Fox made top eight at uh, Super Smash Con last year, man. This guy is definitely a threat, and that's why he's here in the top three of the tournament, man. This is it, man. This is the payout, guys. This is every set here is just more and more money. And uh, we're going into losers finals. The winner of this set will take on Sonics in grand finals uh, here at Juice Box number twelve. Man, top three. Right, right. Uh, yeah, it's definitely gonna be a tough one. I'm trying to find the last tournament. Okay, yeah. See, he got. He's been having some good placements. I think the last time he got top three, he actually did. He take on. Okay, he did not take on Skittles at all, but he beat Sonics. Uh, that one tournament. Yeah, because uh, he had the reverse from Sonics as well, I think. Um, yeah, 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 he beat Sonics yeah. in winners and Sonics beat him in losers with a reverse sweep. And I think the last time uh, Louis Money and Skittles fought, it seems like Skittles won 2-1. So definitely, uh, Louis Money definitely wants a little bit of revenge here for sure. Yeah, this is best of five territory here. Just, you know, 2-1, it's going to be 3-1, uh, 3-0, 3-2. It's going in one of those directions. So... Uh, there's no really way to know uh, who's going to go in the grand finals against Sonics, but uh, I don't know, chat. Who do you guys think that is going to win this set? You got Skittles, you got Louis Money. Uh, we'll, we'll we'll see very shortly. This is best of five sets coming up, man. Uh, I, I have no way of knowing. Again, these guys are both incredible players. Uh, well, so it seems like all all together, these guys are. Um, it's four three in Louis Money's favor. Uh, it seems like they've only played once offline, though, so technically three-piece online because they played at Frostbite 2020. Uh, Louis Money took it 2-1, so these players definitely familiar with each other. Uh, and But since then, it's just been back and forth. It looks like the last winner was actually um, Louis Money at the Cosmic Kerfluffle 2-1 is what it seems like. Right on, but we got a poll going on in the chat, guys. Uh, who do you think is going to go on to Grand Finals? Uh, push one in the chat for Louis Money. Push two in the chat for Skittles. Who's going to Grands? Uh, place your bets right now. Just going into Game 1. Pokemon Stadium 2. Young Link versus Palutena. Let's get it. Yeah, no, this is definitely be a good one. Uh, both these players highly capable of bringing some big energy to these games. Uh, we saw Skittles absolutely tearing people up earlier. So we'll have to see if he's uh, still warmed up here because he did get a little bit of a break. Um, but again, this is Louis Money. Louis Money is a different beast. A really good start to these set so far, man. Uh, both of them chipping away at each other. Both of them playing with fire. He's got explosive flame. He's got his fire arrows. Gets the down throw into the follow-up. Uh, Palatina, very good comboable character. Okay, here we go. Oh, trying to chase him off the stage. It's a bomb. Wow, yeah, almost a really bad spot for Louis Money there. Uh, almost losing a stock potentially. Was able to get back on the stage before being thrown back off stage by Skittles. Uh, both these players trying to dance around each other, but it seems like Skittles just keeps finding the, uh, the advantage in most of these situations. Entire tournament, he's been fighting the mark amazingly with his downers, but uh, the poll results are in. You got 58% going to Louis Money, 41% going to Skittles. But uh, right now, it's looking like Skittles game until I said that he <laughs> overexpended once and yeah. uh, just get blown up. 
Yeah, he kind of uh, he kind of spoke a little too soon. But hey, you know, sometimes it happens, man. <laughs> sometimes things happen a little quicker than we can talk. As we can see right there, as Louis Money finds that up smash. But yeah, right now, sitting about 176. You figured that he'd be losing the stock soon, but now finds a way back to stage and has a bit of an advantage here. Uh, doesn't matter. Going to lose that stock to that Nair. Skittles evening this up, but only 51% separate for two. And sometimes you know you got the sixth sense and you know exactly what you got to put out. That's why Louis Money was able to put out that up smash and get an early stock. But just like that, Skittles taking on 50 plus percent, getting the lead even though he lost his first stock. Right. Good explosive flame, just continuing to build up this damage here. Good string right there. Uh, here's Skittles trying to push his advantage ever more, man. He's, 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 he's pushing. Very careful play between the two. Who should close the gap and get this next time? Skittles learning from history. Not going to follow that again. Avoiding the up smash. There we go. Yep, going to get that down air to take out that second stock. Louis, we'll see how Louis Money can retaliate here. Uh, Skittles is not going to die from that back here, but it certainly was close. And oh, not going to be able to make it back there. Going to lose that second stock. Louis Money applying the offstage pressure, forcing a directional air dodge, and uh, Skittles falling way too short. So now this next stock will be, uh, I guess, foreshadowing a little bit of what's going to move forward next. We'll see who can get this. this isn't, uh, it's impossible to tell which way it's going to go, man. Pretty dead even. Even the poll results were uh, not too one-sided, man. So uh, Skittles, though, trying to get upset. Oh, good grab there. Not going to be able to get anything else off it, though, as Louis Money finds a safe way back down to the stage. Skittles still with a good little uh, lead right here, percentage-wise. Not going to get anything off the fire arrow. Man, these guys really just keep trading back and forth. Yeah. Skittles trying to close the gap right here. Launching some fire arrows, some uh, Zares, some neutral airs. Skittles just tagging on. He hits where it counts, but uh, there's a lot more kill power to penalty and say it's loud. It just fell right into his lap, did nothing about it. Yeah, Louis Money just seemed to drop the ball there. Hopefully it doesn't cost him the game. We got Skittles getting the fire arrows out, trying to find something. Ooh, oh my god! <laughs> just both players parrying each other's moves here. Skittles in the tough spot. We're gonna find the up air to take out that game one. Yeah, there we go. Skittles taking a 1-0 advantage, uh, saying what's up now to the people who voted against in the pool, man. 58% 58, 58 of people were not about Skittles, but uh, Skittles showing up right now, getting the game advantage. But this is still a best of five series. Uh, whoever wins three games will advance the grand finals. And Skittles, first one to get a point on the board, it can still go either way. Yeah, no, um, sorry, just trying to fix this webcam a little bit. But yeah, no, definitely a very good game. A lot of back and forth there. It seemed like... Any little bit of advantage wasn't wasn't lasted for very long. Both these players very good on the defensive end of things, it seems, able to find their way out of bad spots and just continually just kind of flipping back and forth. Uh, unfortunately for Louis Money, ended with that up air to going down 1-0 against Skittles, but Skittles have been hot all night. Um, and I think that game one is more of just kind of them feeling each other out again. You know, it's, it seems to be a common theme. And then game two, I feel like we're about to see some fireworks for sure. Yeah, you're going to run it right back to the same stage. Oh, we got a character swap that we're going to see for the first time in this tournament. We're going to see the fox. And this fox is actually the same fox that double eliminated Cosmos in the small box. So, Louis Money, uh, this is one of his best characters, period. We're going to see if this is going to be what he needs to close it out. Yeah, very interesting to see him go Fox, because I know Fox players in general uh, seem to struggle a little bit online, but man, Louis Money, still one of the best online and offline. So, I mean, if anyone's going to make it work, Louis Money's definitely going to be one of them. This is a step in the right direction. Let's see if uh, Louis Money can use his speed and mobility to his advantage, but this is a, conf this is a confident matchup for us uh, as well. He's a uh, very... Uh, Walt versus in the Fox matchup, he uh, deals with it in the Midwest against Kana every so often. So let's see if he can uh, do something here. Yeah, right now, I mean, these guys are still just trading blows back and forth. Really tough spot to be in. Oh, he's going to be able to make it back. Wow, that was so scary. We're going to find the back and take out that first stock. Really good clean placement. That's going to be a uh, huge... So, uh, you gotta be so precise with Fox's back here, and he finds his mark. 
Louis really Money getting the good advantage. Oh no! Is he alive? He's still alive! Wow. I'm so surprised, man. Fox is one of the lightest characters in the game. I cannot believe he survived that forward here young man. I mean, just amazing DI from Louis Money, it seems. Ooh. Okay, gonna turn around and get that grab. Doing a really good job building up this extra credit here, but the down air gonna take that stock right back. Skittles evening it up. Absolutely clean gameplay for Skittles. I always find these downers, doesn't matter who we're playing against. All right, here we go. A uh, little bit careful play here. Let's see if Skittles can rack up the damage. He's, he's, he's been known to rack up his damage very solidly. Oh, snap. Uh, Blue Money playing a lot better on the stack. Stop. Blue Money's doing a really good job just applying this pressure. Uh, doing a, just doing a really good job in general. Just continuing to find a whole bunch of openings. Just uh, just building on this advantage state that he just continuously <laughs> finds himself in. <laughs> it's, it's actually kind of wild. Like, it's, it's almost like a complete uh, opposite from how game one was, where they kind of just kept trading back and forth. But here, it just seems like Louis oh, Money no just constantly in a good spot. Oh, no, this is so tough. All right, he's going to make it back. Oh, wait, he's not going to make it back. He he's is. Still oh, I don't know what's happening huge, anymore. Man. Skittles took him from the right side to the left side. He just kind of started rocking off the stage, man, closing this percent gap and just doing a brilliant job. And it all started with a fire arrow from the ledge into a dash attack. And wow, got a lead out of that. That's insanity. Skittles is insane. Yeah, man, uh, Skittles, <laughs> just being Skittles, I mean, <laughs> that's, just, that's just how it is. But yeah, I'm sure we'll see Louie Mighty find a way to turn this around real soon. I'll wow, good yep. there. The bomb, though. Oh, finish him. Finish him. He's done. Ooh. That's going to be it. Wow, super good stuff from Skittles. Recognizing the situation that they were in and still closing it out. Skittles going up 2-0. Wants that rematch with Sonics real bad. Yeah, really good uh, efficiency in fighting against Fox. Like, he, did, he did such a really good job, um, especially in the, in the matchups, like Youngling versus Fox. That's what you need to do. You need to find a way to edge guard. And uh, if you're, if you're, I mean, there's there's two kinds of players for Smash Bros. You're either good at fighting spaces or you're not. And if you get this far in tournament, you better be good at fighting spaces, man. Whether it be Fox, Falco, Wolf, uh, the recoveries are definitely challengeable. So, also oh, shout yeah. out. Shout out to you in the Twitch chat who uh, requested to rotate the Jigglypuff for uh, move the Jigglypuff a little bit. I mean, hey, it happens. You know, sometimes you want to see Jigglypuff uh, fix their posture. It was a nice little posture check. And a reminder to check your posture for everybody watching here real quick. Make sure you straighten out your back. Get some stretching in, you know, drink some water. Hydrate as well. Take care of yourselves because we still got a lot of action coming at you here. Uh, as you can see, Jigglypuff doing a really good job making sure they're not ruining their body for the long term. <laughs> And this is huge, man. A 2-0 lead for, uh, for Skittles. And now we're going to go to Kalos Pokemon League. And I'm not sure if we're going to see a character swap or not because this is, uh, this is just it, man. He just kind of murdered Fox's recovery off stage, And uh, I got to wonder if he's going to switch characters or not because Louie Money was doing an incredible job recovering his policy against Pest Ness and even like for the majority of the tournament. So uh, I mean, he might end up switching characters. I don't know. Maybe. Um... I mean, Louis Money is another another person who has multiple multiple characters. Uh, what did you say, Falco? Yeah, Falco. <laughs> I think I think Falco. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it looks like Louis Money is going to be going Falco here. Uh, I thought the Fox was really good. Probably just needed a game to warm up, but um, maybe the Falco is the play. Like you mentioned earlier, actually, you thought he was going to go Falco from the beginning. Yeah, that, that, that was the right move, especially with the reflector. You just have the aggressive reflector. It's like it has a hitbox, and it always just like boom. It gets to you sooner. Point A, point B. It's harder to shield. So I, I, I think Falco is like the wise move. It's just you, when you play multiple characters, you never know if you're going with all of them. You know. Yep. Uh, so yeah, uh, <laughs> Falco definitely a cutscene character. Uh, we'll see if Louis Money is able to get any of those long combos going on here. Uh, getting in on Skittles is definitely going to be a tough task. Skittles likes to use projectiles. Try and create this space and uh, just build up damage. It was just one game away. And, uh, like we did mention before, Louis Money fell to losers to Colonies, where he did try Palatina and Falco and lost both of those games. So that could be why we saw the Fox uh, in this best of five series. 
Yeah, quite possibly, but I mean, right now, doing pretty well. Got a pretty good spot. Oh. Right now, that forward air, is that going to be enough? Nope. Oh, being so aggressive, he's got a, an SD for that. What um, happened? Well, he's just playing with a lot of fire right there. He knew that he could afford to, like, aggress the spacing recovery and still, like, wall jump and come back. But I think he fast fell a little bit too hard and uh, forfeited his stock there, so... Uh, he's not too far from uh, closing this next one, so let's see what he can do. Yeah, yeah, that's Esper. And yeah, I mean, sometimes you just get a little overwhelmed. Uh, maybe that's just what happened, but yeah, Louis Money doing a good job keeping up this pressure, but Skittles with a possible comeback here, building up this damage, trying to close out the stock. Uh-oh. Let's see what we got here for Louis Money. He's not really getting any extra credit at all. No, that's going to be the stock, so Skittles is SD. was not too bad for him. The second stock here on Kalos Pokemon League. Get the combo starter, Falco, looking. Oh, and now he's got to recover, though. Wow. Yo, these guys are just battling off stage right now. <laughs> That's one thing about Falco, man. The Falco players, they go off stage. Every Falco in the world will go off stage. And sometimes it costs them. That's something that Fox can't really do, is uh, go off stage as, as well as Falco can. Okay, wow, okay, there's just a lot of random stuff happening here. But yeah, no, uh, Skittle's doing a good job building up this damage, but it's not sure if it's going to be enough right now because Louie Money is definitely taking advantage of some of these drop conversions that Skittles, I feel like, normally hits. I guess the neutral air off of the mark. It's good to grab. Yep, uh, you can't really phantasm into his field. Otherwise, you are going to eat that grab. And now he's got to do the fire bird. Another SD. Wow. That's twice that Skittles is SD just on the left side of the stage there. Uh, one of them was in a recovery situation, and one was just trying to go for an edge guard and just fell apart. How BM is it if he actually still wins this game with two SDs? <laughs> well, I mean, Skittles is definitely capable. Uh, as we can see, that down air almost taking that second stock. If he can find a way to uh, take out the stack without taking too much more damage, it could very well be on the table. Ooh, oh, great Nair. He's got his jump and his resources. He's going to tether back the ledge, get the trump. But, uh, ooh, looking for a down air doesn't need his mark. Oh, that's gonna be good damage. He's gonna uh, SD oh. three times. Wow, that's uh, really unfortunate. Uh, Louis Money making Falco work. Could this be the turnaround? Could we see Skittles get reverse 3 0'd after reverse 3 0ing the buzz earlier tonight? Whoa, now that was just three SDs. <laughs> yeah, it was, but I mean, who knows? I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe there's just something about uh, Falco. Maybe there's just a little bit of a mental thing going on here. I Maybe it's just misinputs. That's probably what it is. <laughs> Whatever it is, he can't afford to do it six more times. Yeah, that's uh, true. That's he, true. He wants to bring this uh, set to an end and go to grand finals, but this is this this could be just what Louis Money needs is for momentum to carry into this next game. So let's see how it goes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um. Right now, it's looking pretty good. Uh, for Louis Money, got a little bit of momentum behind them right now, finishing that game with a two stock, granted off of essentially three SDs, but looks like we're going to be running it back to Kalos. Maybe Skittles wants to prove a point here, saying, hey, um, you're not going to beat me here. That, that was just a fluke. Watch what, watch what I'm capable of uh, in this game four. Two, one, go! Yeah, I like the idea, too, of running the, the, the counter pick back to the same stage, mostly because I think you also kind of lock your opponent into the stage yet again. Or the, the character, so uh, he, he really wanted another go with the Falco. Running back to the same stage is a good way to do it. Ooh, Louis Money, though, looking pretty good in the beginning here, getting a nice little early 45%. But wow, these guys really just trading back and forth. We'll get the combo started off with the up air, but doesn't do anything with it while it lands oh. aggressively. Fortunate for him, his fall speed is good. He's able to land and shield before he gets murdered by that forward smash. Uh, yeah, Louis Money doing a really good job throwing out some of these hitboxes here. Oh, oh getting a spike to take out that first stock! Off of the wall jump, too. This is exactly what he was looking for. 
Yeah, man, uh, looks like Louis Money is uh, kind of sending a message saying, hey, man, you should have took me somewhere else. Yeah, that those three SDs might have been a fluke, but uh, I ain't no joke, as we can see right here, man. Just continuing to hold oh, on this pressure. Oh, no, he lost his bomb, too. Oh, man, Louis Money, the momentum is in his favor. Looking dangerous right now. He needed that uh, bomb recovery to make it respectable, but now Louis Money looking to bring this to a game five and fast. Yeah, no, this might be in some record time, too. It's been a while since I've seen a Skittles game end quickly, and, you know, with Skittles losing, because Skittles usually doesn't uh, fall down, you know, 3-1 to one that quickly. Finds their downer, but the really good DI coming out from Louis Money. Louis Money one stock away from his game five. Uh, Skittles, I think he's just going to let it happen, honestly, at this point. 85% and counting. Falco can just really go out there, man, just push a bunch of buttons. Oh, wow. There. Yeah, very good pressure from Skittles there. Uh, throwing out the back air and then actually getting the neutral air through Louis Money's shield. Or maybe he dropped the shield, but either way, closing out that first stock. See if he can uh, try to carry this a little further, maybe bring it to a last stock game. But Louis Money kind of, oh, really good usage of the wall jump into the fire arrow. Yeah, no, uh, Skittles looking kind of nice right now, getting some good damage in there. Just when we thought that Louis Money is probably going to have a very easy pass. Uh, okay, maybe that's... Okay, maybe he is. Okay, so he's going to even it up. Two apiece going into a game five. Yeah, keeping him in the air, trapping him, doing a very good job, and just, like, pushing him in a spot where he has to land, and he's catching that landing with the up smash. We got a 2-2 two -two set. We're going to game five. So uh, those, are those of you who voted in the pool earlier, man, 58% of you said that Louis Money was going to take it. 41% said the Skittles was going to take it. I have no way of knowing right now. I mean, this Falco, though, is showing signs of life for Louis Money. Uh, we're going into Game 5. We're going to see Town & City as the pick for the stage, though. Yeah, uh, Town & City. Oh, man, we've seen Skittles do some stuff on this stage today. <laughs> so we could potentially see a repeat. Or uh, we could potentially see Louis Money close out this reverse 3-0 uh, heading into this game five. But man, Town and City, as we saw earlier, is a very strong stage for Skittles. Yeah, let's go ahead and get it. Go right into this game. Uh, this, this is the only game that matters at this point, man. Game five. And this is it. The winner of this goes on to grand finals to see Sonics. Uh, we got first blood going to Louis Money. Clean right there. Oh, what a good combo start. Reverse arrow as well. Uh, this is Town and City Skittles, man. Yeah, I mean, uh, this is such a dangerous place to be in. Skittles, very, very consistent on this stage, able to rack up percentage so fast. As we can see, already at 77% on Louis Money. Louis Money's got to find a way to turn this around quick because this could very well turn into a two stock or three stock game. And finally, Louis Money's starting to get some damage going here. Yeah, Louis Money no longer has access to the walls that Kalos offered him when he was able to get that initial down air in the last game, or even just, like, uh, threaten so much more space. So this is a really good stage pick, I think, for Skittles. Oh, yeah, for sure. All right, going to hit that arrow. All right, good forward air. Still, oh, man, Skittles doing such a good job converting off of these projectiles, man, and just hitting these arrows, just continuously making Louis Money's life a uh, living hell here, just as he, he just can't get back to stage. Yeah, good forward throw, but he's staying alive. Doesn't matter, man. About percent to Louis Money can actually close up the deficit. While wow, falling out of the up tilt, unfortunate for uh, Louis Money there. Not able to get a follow up. Ooh, okay, opening. Okay, not gonna be able to close it out. Ooh, scary spot to be in. Almost uh, ate a down air after throwing out that forward air there. Another forward throw is going to be uh, at least stage control for Skittles, but he needs to do a lot more work if he wants to close up his game. Mm, tough spot. Oh, going to clink right there. Oh, no oh, way. Wow. Oh. <laughs> Un unfortunate for Louis Money not able to find his marker that I was imagining. Now he's going to eat a neutral air, and he got Skittles with a slight lead. Yeah, Skittles with a slight lead, but Louis Money could absolutely close out this stock soon and make this very even. We'll see. Skittles playing very carefully now. Not trying to get caught up in any of Falco's shenanigans. Good reverse up tilt. 
got a uh, Louis Martin just pressuring a certain area of state, so we got the composure from Skittles just keeping him just very calm and collected. Ooh, the up coming out faster than the up smash, keeping him alive. Yeah, oh man, Skittles is definitely turning up here. He's putting on a lot of damage. Still on the third stock. Louis Money not able to take this out yet. He's trying. He's really trying, but Skittles is just doing such a good job of holding all of the stocks. Oh, really scary spot there. Almost eating a forward air, but able to uh, get out of it by throwing out Falco's Nair, which just has a lot of hitboxes going on. Oh, good Ooh, stuff. It, yeah, really good conversion. He tries to, to go for a greedy down smash, which would have got him a three to one stock lead, so I don't hate it. Gets up here to go. I mean, I feel like Skittles can afford to go for some greedy options here. As you can see, getting that Nair, I think, to close out that yep. second stock. Off of the backboard, which is basically the stage, and that's going to be a three to one stock advantage. But Louis Money answering back of the down so but uh, he's on his last stock here in Losers Finals. Town and City working really well for uh, Skittles right now. Oh, oh good no air streams. Yeah, dude. I mean, Skittles, Skittles is just super clean. There's, I don't, I feel like there's never a boring Skittles set, to be honest. Yeah, he finds these openings and just pushes his advantage, and now he's gonna eat another down air. He's man, I swear his like hit rate on these down airs is just so incredible tonight. Oh, oh wow, good boomerang. Money is taking two money hits. Oh, <laughs> these nares is absolutely impressive. Keeping Louie Money off stage with a forward smash. Gonna put Skittles down to his final stock. Well, can Louie Money find a comeback here? Or is it too late? It looks like it is. Oh, no. no. The signature down air is gonna do it for Skittles. Moving him forward into grand finals of Juice Box number 12.